Hi. Hello, 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 hello. I haven't done a video for about a week. I bet you missed me. Or you've seen this flash up and you're like, oh god, I've just done another video. I'm going to have to watch it just to see if like, there's anything I can take the piss out of her over. Um, feel free. That's why you're watching the video because Billy Bob bothered. I will be bothered, I'll cry secretly in my room. Um, hello, hope everyone's okay and you're having a nice, sticky, clammy crap hole of a summer that we're having here in the UK. I'm that's why I'm wearing the stupid bow because my hair's gone all frizzy frizz maru. Um, I hate this sticky weather, I hate it with a passion. Um, mainly today, I've just been laying naked in my room. With all the windows open, and um, but I thought I'd better get up um, to film a video just for you guys. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, it's called an empties video. If you're familiar to YouTube, you'll know that um, lots of beauty, naily, makeupy gurus keep their empties and then they show you if they liked it or not. So I thought I'd do the same. Not that I'm a guru or anything. I'm a guru of getting drunk. I'm really good at that. But not so much the other stuff. Anyway, I'm going to start. Stop babbling. George is somewhere. I'll let you guys say hello to him later. He's doing, he's doing good. Okay, first one. This is Schwarzkopf. Got to be powder for volumizing powder. Now, all my friends come around and they get ready here. And they, I take this out and it's like talcum powder. And I shake it on the roots of their hair. And they're like, Claire, what are you doing? What are you putting in my hair? Um, basically, it's like a powder, hairspray, waxy sort of stuff. It's very strange. Um, but it's, it's root boosting technology. It's just fantastic. If I put my hair up in a mohawk or just feeling like wearing it a bit crazy, you just kind of part your hair, shake it in the roots, and then just massage it up. And the good thing is, not like hairspray, it just kind of disappears. It actually stays in your roots throughout the night. So if you're like doing your makeup in the pub and you're like, oh, I'm looking pretty fan. I'd never say that, but I know some people do. You just massage your hair and you can restyle it. You don't need to take any product with you because it's, it's already in there. It's just like, I don't know, it makes your hair feel dirty. So some people might, might not like that. But if you've got that really flat, George, just knocked the laptop. I'll let you say quickly hello to him. Oh, boo, who's this people here for you? Can you see him? No? Ah, he's the boo. Hopefully you saw him then and I wasn't just pointing in the screen into outer space. Anyway, back to this stuff. It's just great. If you've got really fine hair and you just want a bit of kind of boof, then give it a go. I can't remember how much it was. Superdrug boots. Right, I've done one product in three minutes, 30 seconds. I need to hurry up. Okay, so thumbs up, yes, like it, buy it. This one. You've seen it advertised on telly? Make your teeth wide in just one week. Powerful stain removal for one shade white in one week. New look. Max white one. Active. Colgate. Don't work. Don't buy it. It's really rubbish. My teeth are white anyway. That's because I bought some, like, one pound one from the pound shop. Um, and it's just not worth the hype. I got this with my friend um, in, like, a buy one, get one free deal. And she didn't like it either, so... Don't bother with that one. Um, you're probably better off buying your good old granny pearl drops because that actually does work. Um, so give that a try. Right, next thing. You know I like this if you've watched my What's In My Bag video. It's um, hand sanitizer, but it's a fruity berry one so you don't get that horrible alcohol. Well, it has got an alcohol smell to it, but the berries kind of overpower that. So get one of them, pop it in your bag. I think it was a pound. Next one is a nail. George, get out of there. Nothing for you. Um, is a nail one. And this is 
Marvela Scientifique Nail Hardener. Now this is very bizarre. It's not a nail varnish. It's a lotion. You can see uh, there's a little bit left in the bottom there. It's just like a liquid and it comes with a little brush. Reminds me of lip coat if you remember that. And but what you do is you can only use it um, one or two applications a week because it's really strong. Don't get it on your skin otherwise all your skin will go hard around it. But it soaks right through to the base of your nail. And it does really, really work. Um, you can put it on underneath your nail varnish. Um, I've got gel on at the moment, so I can't use it. So um, I can't really tell you that I like it at the moment. But when I did use it and I had naked nails, it really did make them hard. So Marvela. I think I got this one from a chemist, but I'm pretty sure Boots do it. It's quite, quite expensive. Um, I might, if you're really lucky, put links to everything that I'm putting back in the bag in the description bar. Okay. Someone recommended OPI Nail Envy. I think you can use that one more than once a week. So maybe I'll give that one a go because my nails are really bendy. Can you see? They're like paper because I just put the gels on too much and peel it off. Right, quick, 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 Claire, quick, quick! Perfume, soap and glory, 15 quid, boots, really like it. Makes you smell all fresh and clean. It's like all the other soap and glory stuff here, it's really nice, but um, it's just really cheap for a perfume, 15 quid, so. Um, next one, this was a luxury gift, Laura Mercier Almond and Coconut Milk, it's a body cream, I use it as a hand cream, oh, if you've never smelt this stuff you've got to go um, wherever sell Laura Mercier, I think John Lewis and House of Fraser probably sell it, but if you're um, in the UK, if you go to Space NK, I think it used to be Space Apothecary or something, it's called Space NK, and you go in there, they've got the whole Laura Mercier range, and they do these big, huge tubs of it. Um, well, it's like a big jar. It's, I think it's about 55 quid, but um, it's so, so nice, and you don't need much. I could eat it. It is like souffle. It's body and bath, Laura Mercier. Um, it's just really, really nice. The perfumes are really nice as well. Um, next one. Neutrogena Visibly Clear Pink Grapefruit Face Wash. Helps eliminate spots and blackheads with a fresh, clean feel. The fresh, clean feel thing definitely, 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 definitely works because grapefruit is really refreshing. So I use that in the morning to wake me up of my slumber. If it's still morning, that is. Sometimes I get up about one or two, but... Um, yeah, whenever I wake up. Visibly clear. They do do an orange one, but that doesn't smell as nice. Definitely get the grapefruit one if you're going to try it out. Um, it did clear my skin. Um, I always get outbreaks all the time. I think it's because of all the junk that I eat. If I ate healthy, I'd probably have gorgeous skin, but I don't. I eat KFC and Domino's and... Cheese. Oh yeah, other things apart from that, but they're the naughty things. Chocolate. Oh sorry, Bear Bear, did Mummy make you jumpy? Sorry, Bear. Okay, other things that are nice and fresh. I've been all about their rejuvenation in the mornings to wake me up. Um Alberto Balsam Tea Tree Tingle Shampoo and Conditioner really really nice i think i got this in again it was just like a cheapy pound shop pound stretcher one of those jobs and i when i went to asda to order online they only had the shampoo they didn't have the conditioner so i got the tea tree shampoo and the apple conditioner but they work really nicely together and once you've washed your hair you can still smell that nice tea tree yoki smell and it's got mint extracts in it as well so definitely recommend that we did buy the orange one, which I think was um, apricot. They do a strawberry one as well, but usually I'm put off by the green things because it's like a boy colour. 
but I went, I've got it and I liked it. And that's really cheap shampoo too. Probably could do with a better conditioner for my over bleached damaged hair, but never mind. Just leave it on a bit longer. Okay, next one. Cocoa Butter Formula Natural Bronzing Gradual Tanner Moisturiser. Now, did I say Palmer's? Palmer's. It's one of my pet hates is um, the tanning moisturisers that stink of biscuits. But not nice biscuits either. Like if I walked around smelling like a bourbon or, um, I don't know, custard cream. But it's not, it's like cheap digestive smell. Nobody likes them, unless they don't in tea. So I went for this one because I really like the smell of cocoa butter and it does smell like cocoa butter. There's a tiny, tiny, tiny hint, which Palmer's, if you're watching this video, because I know you do, watch all my videos, please take that biscuit smell out. It's almost, you've almost got it. You know, if I was a scientist, I'd be like, you're almost there, like 99%, but... It's much better than the um, Johnson's one, most definitely. So I think it's quite expensive because it, it actually really softens your skin nice too. Yeah, all I can smell is cocoa butter. I put the last of this on just now. So give it a go. I think it's more than a fiver though. So I liked it. Another one. This is a skin one. I think I might have shown you this before. It's my favourite toner. Um, all the makeup ladies were raving about it on YouTube and I thought well, I've got to get this stuff because it must be a miracle and it does actually clear your skin it's um, Bioderma it's made in France you can't get it over here unless you get it on eBay there's no shops that sell it I've looked everywhere email people you can only get it online um, I got two I think it might have been ten pounds. It's five pounds a bottle. It's quite a lot for a toner, but it really, really, really works. Put it on before your moisturizer, or put it on before you go to bed, and it does clear your skin, and it gets your um, eye makeup off, makeup off really easily. I was really surprised because it's so, it's got no scent, doesn't skin, doesn't sting your skin, but couple of wipes and your eye makeup is gone so there must be some secret fairy dust in it that gets rid of it next one when I do my roots which I haven't done for a while can you see that beautiful but I need my hair cut and I always do my roots after that because there's no point bleaching hair you're gonna get chopped off after I've bleached my hair I always put a tone on it and this time I got Crazy colour platinum. I think it was three ninety nine, and I just got the lilac as well because I was going to put a bit of lilac through it when I next do my hair. Hasn't really got a smell. Don't leave it on too long. The best thing to do is if you've got yellowy roots like me, then put it on as if you were bleaching your roots. So put it in a dish with your brush and blob it on your roots, and then leave it for. 10 minutes and then comb it through the rest of your hair don't just slap it all on because then your roots will be kind of blondy but then your tips will be silver um so yes take care unless your hair is all one color then you can slap it on but if you've got yellowy roots definitely put it on with a brush two left sorry i'm going on Okay, another thing that I got caught into buying because I was watching too many YouTube tutorials was this liquid gold stuff, Alpha H with glycolic acid. Now this is, it is an acid, but it's a, a gentle one. Now it's um, like a liquid exfoliant. Um, the bottle is just too small for me to tell you if it worked or not. Um... I think I was probably using too much. But you put it on a cotton pad before you go to bed. I think you only use it a few times a week. Um, if you want it to have less of an effect, then put moisturiser on afterwards. But I think if I'd have carried on using it, because I f some weeks I forgot, and some days I went to bed with my makeup on, which, you know, I can't tell you that I've got 
really good scheme from using this when I've been using loads of other stuff so what I need to do is get some more and just use this because I think it will work I hate liquid gold shall I read the backs for you revitalizes and assists in firming the skin in a single application through a multi-action formula of silk protein and licorice Liquid. <laughs> it was like acid. Concentrated skincare, definitely. I think probably if I'd used it every day of the week, it would have made a difference. Okay, last one, which is a little bit of a cheat because it isn't actually empty yet, but it will be in a couple of days. Mac brush cleaner. Can't fault it. I've started to really look after my brushes because um my neighbour's going out. Oh, he might say hello to George in a minute, this is his friend. Um, I have been watching some tutorials that you can mix uh, pro isopropyl alcohol and tea tree oil and make your own brush cleaner um, because the tea tree is um, antiseptic and the isopropyl alcohol cleans and evaporates really quick, which I think... Is probably in this, but I don't know the ingredients of this or the through the box away, and it's not on the back. But it's really good. Get a paper towel, swish some on, just get your brush and swirl, 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 and it cleans it within like 30 seconds, and then they dry within 10 minutes. So, um, yeah, I would repurchase this, it was 10 pounds. So, I am thinking about getting like a big litre bottle of this alcohol and tea tree and make my own and if it works I might bottle it and sell it to all you lot so but you probably don't clean your brushes I don't know if you do or not that's it they are my empties 17 minutes of emptiness come here bears come here I'll just give you a little update on the bear come here stop babbling he's doing really well his ears better he had an ear infection he had an eye infection um, and it was leaking green goo again but he seems to be doing really well he's still doing his funny cough thing but he's due to have his CT scan next month so I'm gonna get him to um, scan his throat as well just to check it hasn't spread um, that is all for now please leave comments in the comments box and rate and subscribe if you want to if you want to leave a comment of a video you'd like me to do another George video or I don't know what else I can make him do I could dress him up for you if you want he likes dressing up that is all um, yeah, carry on enjoying the clammy weather you UK people and if um you have a chance go and look up Russell Brand um, news um, interview in America so I just watched that and I was cracking myself laughing it was just the funniest thing ever so go and have a look anyway um, have a good rest of week and weekend and I shall see you in my next video hopefully it'll be Tony does my makeup if I can convince him to do it, he's really nervous, bless him, but I will make him do it, he just doesn't want to talk, so maybe I'll just, I don't know, let him not talk, <laughs> bless him, anyway, see you later, love you lots like jelly tops, jelly tops are sweets, by the way, in the UK, bye.